Well, happy Tuesday, everyone. We've got some isolated showers on the way today. Most of us stay dry. It's really more of just kind of an easing in to a weather pattern that's really going to take over for the better part of the week. Off and on again, rain tomorrow again, not wash out, not all day. But by Thursday, we are looking at widespread soaking rain out there coming our way. Let's take a look. Live Super Doppler 4 radar. Very early this morning, we've got a lot of clouds. There is some rainfall nearby. In fact, it's easing into parts of Georgia right now and look at that. We've just got a lot of rainfall to our west. So some of this will kind of creep north and, and cause some isolated showers for us at times. But again, not everybody gets wet. It's just going to be kind of that signal that things are changing. Here's a look at tomorrow from isolated rain today to a few scattered showers tomorrow. We'll see a few of those in the morning. We'll see a few more in the afternoon and possibly even a few more into late afternoon and evening. So you could see not a washout, not an all day rain, but again, a little bit more rainfall will be around for your Wednesday. As we go into Thursday, here is that widespread soaking rain. It starts very early in the morning, so I think Thursday everybody has a chance of getting wet. We'll see some of those isolated downpours possible uh, and even maybe a thunderstorm or two. We'll see. It's going to be a very warm, warm day on Thursday. We're talking about highs in the upper 60s, so we'll have a lot of warmth for that rain to work with. By the way, that's Thursday's rain, but look at Friday. We are right back to it, particularly later in the day. So again, not a washout, not an all all day rain Friday, but there will be rain around as we go into Saturday. One last system that should bring some rainfall later in the day Saturday, possibly into very early Sunday before we clear out and dry out for the remainder of the weekend and into next week. So as we take a look at our rainfall totals for Wednesday, here we go. Some of us could see nothing. Some may get some decent measurable rain, but look at that compared to Thursday. It's just going to be widespread soaking rain. We're going to add to it a little bit bit more heading into Friday and possibly late Saturday into early Sunday. So we've got enough rainfall to catapult us into at the very least one of the top five wettest Januaries on record. Remember, we've already had a lot of rain just a couple uh, weeks ago and now we're getting more pretty much every day for some all the way through early Sunday morning. Good news is by Monday we are back to normal. That's temperatures in the 50s for daytime highs and how about some sunshine. That'll be pretty nice too in the mountains in the 40s by Monday.